Do the Titans have a miracle left in them? The Titans can win the next 20 Super Bowls. Kicked it high and short. But there will never be a moment in my life like that moment in time he throws it across the field to when your team has just won one of the most remarkable playoff games in history. It's a miracle! And it's the first one ever played here. What do you say? Tennessee has pulled a miracle! As we went through the first year of the Tennessee Titans, we had three goals. We wanted to make the playoffs, we wanted to sell out every game, and we wanted to host a playoff game. And for me, the first year had gone about as well as I could have hoped because my number one goal in that year was don't get noticed. But it all worked well until we played Buffalo on that Saturday. From Adelphia Coliseum in Nashville. Hello again, everybody. I'm Mike Keith with Cody Allison, Pat Ryan, and Larry Stone. We're just minutes away from the kickoff between the Titans and Bill. I overprepared. I don't remember sleeping. This was my first playoff game. I wanted to be the very best that I could. And the truth is, for the majority of the game, I stunk up the joint. I was terrible. It was far and away my worst broadcast of the year. I thought they were going to fire me after the game. Snap, set, kick, winds its way down the That's field. Good. He made it just inside the upright. As the Bills are on the verge of coming to Nashville and picking up their 12th win of the season and advancing to the second round. My goal at that point is don't sound disappointed. Do the Titans have a miracle left in them in what has been a magical season to this point? If they do, they need it now. What stood out to me, they had never practiced home run throwback with anything other than a squib kick. So on their end, it was a huge surprise that Christie kicked it up in the air. Massive shock. Christie kicks it high and short. I'm just trying to call what I see and keep it as simple as possible. Going to be fielded by Lorenzo Neal at the 25. Yeah, give pitches it, it back to Wycheck. The greatest thing, in my opinion, about the call is the color commentator, Pat Ryan. He saw immediately that there was no one up the sideline. He throws it across the field to Dyson. He's got something. 30. I'm like, 30, look. 40, look. 50, look. And then I'm pretty convinced there's not a flag down, and so then I go absolutely nuts. 10, He's got five, it! End zone! Touchdown, Titans! There are no flags on the field! It's a miracle! Tennessee has pulled a miracle! A miracle for the Titans! I look back at Larry Stone, our executive producer, and he's got tears just streaming down his face. And we just didn't talk for like a minute. That was the moment where we became an NFL city. Everybody knew what it was like and never forgot. It. There will never be a moment in my life like that moment in time when your team, the team that took a chance on you, that hired you, and that gave you that incredible opportunity, has just won one of the most remarkable playoff games in history. And it's the first one ever played here. <laughs> Doesn't get old. Preparation is 95% of it. The ability that we have to utilize technology is what really makes it so great. The Microsoft Surface makes it easy to get to everything. Do you find a balance of preparation and the ability to be in the moment?